uh, a word of witness in this in these times that we're in. You know, in, in 20, 2013. 2013 is really 2012, right? That's part of the trick here. Yeah, 2013. But this is still a jubilee year, if you understand. You know, a jubilee year for I and I as the once lost but now found Beta Israel, the so called Negroes, the Ethiopian Hebrews, at home and abroad. So this psalm, I touched on Psalm 76. So let's just touch on the psalm before. This psalm, so I'm going to deal with the first, the English, right? The English right here, and the English Psalm 75. Mm -hmm. It's to the chief musician, and it's called in Hebrew Al Taskhit, Al Taskhit, right? Which means basically, do not um, destroy or destroy not. Bamarinya Tatifa, do not destroy, destroy not. And it's a song or a a psalm or a song of Asaf, and this is Psalm 75. And we're also going to just chant it Bamarinya from the Met of Kedus from Halasalasi's Bible, and just briefly compare and what the Holy Spirit reveals to us. All praises be Besama Awa the Memphis Kedusa Hadu Amla to the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. In the name of the Father, in in the name of the Father, to the Father, in the name of the Father, but in the name of the Son is the authority, Adonai, right? Yeshua, I, Hamushia, I, Gita, Jesus Christos. It says, to thee, O Jah, do we, I and I, give thanks, give young for eyes. To thee do we give thanks, young for eyes, for that thy name, Kedamawi, Haile Selassie, O Abu Kedus, is near, Thy wondrous works declare. When I shall receive the congregation, I will judge uprightly. The earth and all the inhabitants thereof are dissolved. I bear up the pillars of it, Selah. I said to the fools, deal not foolishly, and to the wicked and the weak-hearted, lift not up the horn, lift up not the ill canoodle, the demon horns, lift not up your horns on high, speak not with a stiff neck, for promotion cometh neither from the east, nor from the west, nor from the south, but Jah, but Hashem is the judge, he putteth down one, and setteth up another, for in the hand of Yahweh there is a cup, and the wine is red. It is full of mixture, and he poureth out of the same. But the dregs thereof, all the wicked and the weak-hearted of the earth, shall wring them out and drink them. But I, and I and I, and Rastafari, will declare for Iva. I and I will sing praises, Miskana, to the God of Yaiko. All the horns of the wicked, all the horns of the of the the, the, the Baphomet, all the horns of the weak heart and wicked also will I and I cut off. But the horn of the righteous shall be exalted. Amen and Amen. Now, mm, uh, whoa, may I and I chant and praise and prayers go up before the eye as the incense, the ancients. Mm. Amen. Now, Bamarinya, the Sama'ab, the world is what manifests produce a hadu amlak. Mesmore Dawit, Mesmore Seba. Arat seba mis le mesmerana leka atatifa ya asaf ye miskana mesmor avetu ina mesegin na halen ina mesegin na halen sin hinem main teralen tamrate hino hulu na garalo gizewina sikabel in the kin for Dalo, Midrina Berswawista Yamia Noruta Huluk Alatu, 
Inemamisesochoanatanau Kubra kamisraka wima kamiraba wima kamidre beda yelemina. Egziabi hera feraja no winna. Yihinya wardal, yihinima yakabral. Swabe egziabi hera ija no winna. Yalla tekala kele ye wine at eja molabet. Kazi wadaziya agala beto Negrgina talaw ala fasasem Yemidra khat ya tenyo chuhulu yitetu tal Ine gina lezlalle madesi lanyal Leya ikobi mamlak zamarina karbalo Ye khat yaninak endo chuhulu sabralo Ye sadikanak endo chagin kef kef yilalu Kubur lakalu, kubur dimtsu, kubur lahailu Kubur le mowa anbesa zem negede Yehuda Kadamawi khayla salase Siyume egziyave her negusa neges ze Ethiopia Bege tachin na, be melhane tachin, be Yesus Christos sim. Yuhun, yuhun. Amen. Oh, this psalm, now this, this, when we, when we, when we compare this psalm, Psalm 75, and, and Psalm 75 along with Psalm 76 are, are connected with this, with this war against the Lamb, with the, with the rising of God, Hashem, the rising of the King of Kings, I and I Father, as mentioned in 76, and, this, and, and the sound, the judgment that he causes to be heard from heaven. Now remember, 20, 2013 is actually 2012. Now, the, their Pope, Gregory and, and the Nicolaitanes, flip mode everything. Right, not to even get into the details of that, but let's just touch on this psalm for a moment. This psalm is very, very important because of a couple of prophetic things it touches on. First of all, it begins off from Rastafari foundation of young for eyes of the thanks and praises and the declaration of the Most High's name, the decoration of Kedamawi Haile Selassie's name, the decoration of the Hashim's name, the decoration of Abba Kedus Kedus Kedus's name. According to the wondrous works, according to the works of Nagusa Neges, according to the works and the testimony of our Father. Now it speaks about a judgment coming forward. It speaks about the earth and all the inhabitants thereof being dissolved. This is that end time scenario that, that many are speaking of, bearing witness to, and a lot of movies and other things talking about at the end of the world, 2012. Remember, the calendar is off, right? There's a conclave going on, sequestration, all of these prophetic signs, the seven and the eight. Um, kings or the beast and all of that beast prophecy and the two Babylons is, is unfolding right before us. But it's I and I, Rastafari and the true and faithful Cristiano who bear up the pillars, right? We be up that truth, the real support, right, of the truth upon this earth of God and Christ. Now notice verse 4, it says that, that he says to the fools, to the foolish, what's the foolish? What's the qualification of the foolish? that the fools say in their heart there is no God because they don't trust the word of Jah. They think that the, the Bible, the scripture is just a metaphor. It's a metaphor and reality. You know what I'm saying? But the fools will be foolish and doolish. But say to the fools, deal not foolishly. Don't go on in your foolishness, in your folly, in your fuckery, and speaking blasphemies against the king of kings and his Christ. And to the wicked, lift not up the horn. 
very interesting. It speaks about this horn that the wicked lift up, and we're all familiar, you understand, with this horn. But then the righteous also have horns as well. Let's recognize that in this particular scripture right here in the Mesmura Dawit. So when it goes forward, it speaks to them doubly this. This is taught double. Remember, there are two Babylons. So verse 4 and verse 5 is speaking double, double trouble to Babylon, double trouble to the enemies of the king of kings and his Christ, double trouble to those who war against the Lamb as we're in this particular season between Purim and Passover. And Passover is all about, you understand, know Passover is all about the Lamb, the true Lamb of God, right? The true Lamb of God and the true Lamb of God um, is Yeshua HaMoshiach, our black Lord and Savior, Adonai, Yeshua I, HaMoshiach I. Now, let's go on with this. So don't lift up the horn, right? Lift, up, lift not up the horn, so twice it's mentioned. Then it says, promotion cometh neither from the east, nor from the west, nor from the south. And right now, the Romans, the Babylonians, right, the papacy, are trying to find out who's the daddy, who is their daddy, which proves that they are the product of fornication. They don't know their father. But I and I, Rastafari, we know our father, right? We know our father. They don't know their father. Maybe they're going to call Maury Povich, right, to come in to their conclave and try to figure out who's the father. The foolish, you understand, so foolish. Promotion doesn't come from the east. It doesn't come from the west, nor from the south. Notice the, the north is not mentioned here, prophetics, prophetics. But Jah is the judge. Hashem is the judge, Baruchu. He putteth down one and setteth up another. If you want to blame anyone for this so-called conspiracy, which is prophecy, then it's our father. Our father is behind the conspiracy. It's, it's the mystery of God in Christ. He wrote it from ancient times. Hath you not heard? He putteth down one and setteth up another. For in the hand of yod Hey wow Hey, in the hand of Egeziadi Herlotu Sephat, there is a cup. And it says that the wine is red. But now in the King James, it says it's full of mixture. Again, in the Met of Kedus and Haile Selassie Bible, right, in the Revised Amharic Bible, if we look at this particular verse, it says, verse, uh, verse, it says, right, it says that it is not. Right? It doesn't say that it is not, right? It is not mixed, right? It is not mixed. So those nuances are very important for I and I on the spiritual front line to recognize. It says, He pours out of the same, but the dregs thereof, all the wicked of the earth, shall ring out and drink them. Right? Shall ring out and drink them. Now it says, Verse 9, but I, and I, and I, and I will declare forever. So it's about speaking that truth. It's about your true voice. The angels, our, I, and I, angels, the angels of the Father, they, 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 they don't have no favoritism on your face or your face or you think you're cute. No, it's our true voice. It's that true testimony. It's that resonance on the spiritual level. It says, I will sing the singing of praises to the God of Jacob. Note the God of Jacob because this is Jacob's trouble. They don't know Jack. They don't know Black Jack. They don't know Black Jacob. And they've rolled the dice and they've gambled against the King of Kings and his Christ. And they have lost. Verse 10, all the horns of the wicked and the weak heart also will I and I cut off. But the horns of the righteous, the horn of David... The horn of great King David, the African Sion, shall be exalted. And this leads straight into the next psalm, Psalm 76, that we read previous, right? Um, in Judah is God known. His name is great 
in Israel, in Judah, for it is evident that our Adonai sprang from the tribe of Judah, which Moses made no mention of. Behold, Moa and Bessa Zeim and Negeda Yehuda. Edomawi Haile Selassie, the one who the world says was dead. Behold, he lives forever more. Shalom Rastafari.